hey guys so finally samsung pay is live here in india it's working well i tested this myself if you didn't know the latest update from samsung enabled this tap and fee feature on the galaxy watch 4 and up the software update did have some issues but samsung seems to have fixed it now let's find out how to set this up and everything you should know don't forget to like this video guys subscribe let's begin the first thing most people seem to forget is enable tap and pay in your card settings go into your card controls or manage card and you need to enable this also set transaction limit for this uh, tap and pay feature for the security reasons uh, currently i believe this is 5000 rupees so you can change it as per your requirement this feature is also known as contactless or the tokenized payment so anything you see with these settings just enable these now let's get down to the business so the first thing that you need to have is a samsung phone with obviously a samsung account so the first thing you need to do is going to the samsung wallet and here you need to click on the credit debit card option and add the card that you want to use with the samsung pay for tap and pay so you can see i have already added it so i'm not going to do it so all you have to do is just add it manually or you can use the nfc feature to add the card or you can scan the card with the camera it's fairly simple now the next step is to press down on the back button and click ok to install the samsung watch plugin on the phone so you can see here it directly takes you to the play store so once you install this just open this and uh, just make sure you click ok and allow all the permissions so that it works without any issues and finally you will get to the screen to add the card where you have two options one is to add the card or to import the cards if you didn't already set up the card in the wallet you can directly do it from here however since we have already done it we are going to go with importing the cards from the wallet so click on the import cards and you can see it turns up right here now click on activate this will activate the card on the watch so here you need to set up the pin which is very important so whenever you make a payment you need to enter that pin in order to unlock the tap and pay feature so that it works as a security layer you can also choose pattern if you wish to however i am choosing the pin and that's pretty much it on the watch so you can see the watch pin is already set up again you need to enter the cvv and expiry to complete the process so now when you press and hold you will see this option to set the default payment method so go ahead and choose this option to make the samsung pay as the default payment method so this marks the end of setting up the card on your watch so whenever you are going to make a payment make sure that the nfc is turned on and just press down on the back button and enter the pin code now this will stay on for about a couple minutes or so so that you are prepared to make the payment and also make sure guys that uh, when you hear the first beep just uh, keep it on for a little longer so that the payment doesn't get aborted as you can see in this example so the right way to do is tap the top portion of your watch on the nfc symbol as you can see there once you hear the beep just wait a couple seconds longer so that the transaction gets through if you have any questions feel free to comment down below i'll try and answer them and also let me know if you want to make a video on how to make this work for non-samsung users so that's been it for this video guys don't forget to like and also subscribe to the channel thanks for watching i'll see you soon